Hey, high schoolers, listen up. If you're getting ready for school right now, or even parents, you can let your kids know about this if they're still sleeping. We have a wonderful career fair happening next week. It's going to be at Battle Mountain High School. Here to tell us more about it and their participation, we have Tracy LeClaire, and she's the community risk manager of the Eagle River Fire Protection District. And Tracy, this is a great way for kids to really just see what kind of jobs are out there. You're going to have a lot of different professions on hand to talk to them. It is. It's a great, we have a great turnout. Um, employers from a, across the county will, will come out, uh, give kids the opportunity to talk to people who are actually working in that field and find out a little bit more about things they may be interested in and where they want to take their career paths. Well, I think it's so hard when you're 15, 16, 17, 18 to know what you want to be when you grow up. Oh, absolutely. What a job entails. There's so many different professions mm -hmm. out there today. It is, and that's what's great about this program is that they're able to actually talk to people who are uh, doing that job on a day-to-day -day basis, uh, ask them questions about, uh, you know, what classes did they take in school, uh, what, what were the things that were important to get them to where they are in their career path. Well, let's ask you, what was it like? What, when did you decide, hey, I want to work for the fire and rescue and the fire department here? Uh, you know, it, it's one of those things that it just kind of grew over time. Um, you know, I think back to, I, I majored in marketing and advertising in school, um, but found out pretty quickly that wasn't really what I wanted to do. And in the fire service, we help people, yes. and that's really important. Yes, and also, you're not only in the fire service helping people, but community risk managers. So even within a fire department, there are going to be different roles for different people. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, we have firefighters who are out there, you know, they're the ones fighting fires, uh, structure fires, wildland fires, uh, you know, car extrications. My job as an educator is to really... Um, hopefully help make sure that that uh, emergency situation doesn't happen in the first place. Okay, yes, and it's really interesting for these high schoolers to see the different career paths. If they don't wanna move away, sometimes you have to move to a bigger city. We are a pretty small town. If you wanna stay close, close to home, this could be a great career path for it someone. It is, and we, we actually, um, you know, the, the area of familiarity is huge, and um, so we would love to have more local kids uh, bilingual. Uh, yeah. Spanish speaking is also a, a really big thing because we have such a large Hispanic population here. Okay. Well, Tracy, so anything special you guys are bringing to the, the career fair? Any, I'll are you going to bring the fire truck out there? We'll have the fire <laughs> truck. Uh, I'll have a crew with me. Uh, we'll probably bring in some of the firefighter equipment and gear. And, so you can put um, on the coat and yeah, feel yeah, it. Yeah, they, they can see the SCBA and the bunker gear. So. Well, it should, should be, be great. Should be fun. Have you guys done this before? Have you participated in yes. this rotary yeah, event? We, yeah, we try to do it every year. Okay. Well, it's probably nice to get the kids excited about it and uh, and remember once again how you got into this profession yourself and kind of justify what you're doing. Oh yeah, it's it's great. And uh, talking to the kids, um, you know, their enthusiasm and they have their whole lives ahead of them. So yes. it, it's it's a lot of fun. All right, it is the career fair. It's the Rotary High School career fair held at Battle Mountain High School, April fifth, starting at nine a.m. So kids, listen up and get on over to Battle Mountain and learn more about this job and so many other professions. We'll be talking to more professionals throughout the show about what will be found at the career fair. We have Mark Sassy. He's standing by. He's going to let us know about this upcoming storm heading our way.